You come here to move through time and through space. Allow the eyes to gently close. Smile your very best smile. Swallow the smile with some saliva into the heart and let the heart smile back at you. And there's a warm and a welcoming feeling. Joy without end. Grace, beauty, laughter. The deep knowing of the wise being that you are. And the golden glow that comes from the heart comes from a golden flower. And use the gold light from the center of the flower like a sunbeam and beam it onto those petals and wake them up. There is a second part that's very personal. And this is to step inside the pearl itself. Because if you step inside the pearl, you could find out who you are. Elisis Livingston is a professional faith healer. She runs the Shambhala Retreat in Glastonbury. For £140 a day, she treats patients, including those with terminal cancer, with a mix of meditation, spiritual healing, and the playing of recorded chants. She believes she can alter the structure of DNA. Quite an experience. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> yes. DNA is very interesting right now in our, the evolution of the human race. Um, every human being, except um, a very small percentage, has a double helix in the cell. We and don't all have. Oh, okay. everyone. No, you said uh, a very small percentage. Oh, no, a very small percentage do not. Really? They have got more strands. Um, we used to have, in Atlantis, 12 strands, and they're in the form of four triangles facing in, in each cell. And we forgot who we were in the experiment after Atlantis, mm -hmm. and everything changed. Reincarnation was introduced. The soul I know what you're thinking. Heart. This woman is way out. I expected a serious program about the attack on science, and here's Richard Dawkins just picking on an easy target. But these ideas are not so weird in the irrational world of alternative health. In fact, they're commonplace. Is Elises' theory of DNA from Atlantis any more irrational than the Ayurvedic notion of chakras, seven spinning energy wheels inside us? They're certainly great money spinners. How do we know all this? Where, where does all this come from? Um, it comes from the Akashic record, the record of all vibration on this planet. Uh, we also have knowing. In, when we were doing the heart meditation, you go into the deep knowing. And the deep knowing, it really can't be argued. What you know, I know that you realise this, of course, you know. Well, I, I, I know that DNA is a double helix, but that's only been known since 1953. How is her evidence, the knowing of this Akashic record, any worse than the evidence for homeopathic claims that the more you dilute an active ingredient, the more effective it becomes? Both depend on faith. Apparently, I'm only a few DNA strands short of the full Atlantean quota. Elisis kindly agrees to top me up. So, let's put the last triangle in. And it's done. <laughs> Let me know in six months how you're feeling. I'll wait and see if I get any any, yes, any, any effects. Yes. <laughs>